Hey, yo, what's good, everybody? This is your boy, Pyramid of Bosses, coming at you with another reaction video. This reaction is to Trap Terrell's Timmy Turner Story Part 9. Now, <clears throat> I love the Timmy, Tor the Timmy Turner Story all together because it's, to me, I, this, the this is actually what made me start listening to Trap Terrell when I first heard the Tim, the first Timmy Turner story. So, we gonna go ahead on, hop on to this part nine. Do you feel me? Yeah, I forgot that they said that it was going to be um, featuring Rick and Morty, but to find out that the, they're the cops, it's kind of unexpected. Things. They want to protect the streets. No, they protect who in the streets. They do it with charging the fee. Yeah, Rick and Morty, dirty cops. I can see that happening. But right now they money fucked up Cause everybody got fucked up And they're assigned to handle this case And they want to to see what's what Cause Rick want his cash, boy This the year that he retire and sit on his ass, boy That's why he got Morty rolling with him Just to show him how to get a bag, boy But Jimmy ass got trash, boy And Carl dead and he the last one That was paying fees just to stay free And that's the shit that got Rick mad, boy But fuck it, somebody know something But everyone dead They even killed Chester But they hit the streets Cause they got some fussing to see him as cops So nobody know nothing Okay. What I'm thinking about is I'm still I'm thinking about one through nine. I mean one part was one through eight. And there's technically there's still a main character that they didn't even that he didn't touch on yet. So somehow I got a feeling that he gonna come up. You know, Jim, Jimmy Neutron's one of his best friends, Sheen. He had Carl. Carl dead. So, I think he gonna end up bringing Sheen in. They'll get some discussion. They'll pull up on niggas and slam them and rough them and kick them and punch them and sweep them and dust them and soon find out that they got a sister. His sister name is Libby. I forgot all about Libby. Well, the big head there. Ain't gonna lie, Libby bad. Libby got long hair, big brown eyes, small waist with the ass. They don't give a fuck about that. Found out where she lived. Shit. He made Libby into one of the baddest chicks out here, you feel me? Congratulations, my dude. Pulled up, said they had some questions about when a brother had passed. They really don't give a fuck. They want to know who in charge now. They want to know who playing ace. They want to know who did the cars now. Cause there's some shit going around town. The car had a million in the damn ground. And when the cops went and searched his crib, it wasn't one dollar that was even found. So he's going. Oh, somebody claimed took that money. If he had a mill in the ground, you know, which means he had a mill before he got killed. And they ain't found nothing. Somebody took that. Somebody found it before the cops and took that. I died, so I had to get it. So they told Libby, fuck Timmy, let's talk Carl. Was Timmy AJ really close? That can help us finally get this case. So My bad, y'all. Hey. hey. My bad, y'all. I'm by my job. So I'm like, it's people walking up to me, talking to me, you know, people that I know. So I'm gonna go ahead and hop back on in the video though. My bad, y'all. Uh, she shook her head like nigga nah. They was cool, but not a close thing. My bro was close with the nigga Chester. Car was close with the nigga Sheen and say who is I knew it. I knew they was gonna I knew he was gonna bring Sheen up in the air too. He's running out of characters. 
thing. Oh, he the plug. He the one that supply the drugs. He come off as a goofy nigga, but won't hesitate to fill your ass with slugs. They asked the dude, she know what she seen that. She told him he be chilling with his cousin. Who his cousin? Nick Dean. They think they meek and old men and something, but that's all I really know. Do you think daddy killed my bro? Shorty ass snitching, bro. Like, shorty snitching like a mob. At all of them, you gonna make her the snitch. Damn, that's bad. That's sad, man. Why? Well, somebody got a snitch, you feel me? Oh, Rick looked down and more than more than looked at him and they both told him no. Rick said one more question, then we'll exit out your door. Can't tell us what Nick hang? She said buy the liquor store. Shit, that's right up Rick Allen. So they left Libby house. Libby walked to her living room, took her seat on the couch. Maybe she picked up a phone, looking for a number she can dial. Called the homegirl, Cindy, and told her, girl, the plan in motion now. Ooh, hold on. That sound like a setup. That sound like, okay, check this. We finna get whoever in charge about it. So that's why she's snitching. This is how, how I see it going down. She's snitching to the cops so that they'll take him out or whoever in charge out, you feel me? And after they can, after they take them out, nobody gonna be in charge and bam, that's they time to step in. That's how I see that going down. Trap. Once again, another banger. I love these episodes. Keep them coming, brother. I already know you setting up for a part 10. The way you ended this, it's the way you ended this one is setting up for a part 10, and I can see that, bro. Do your thing, man. Salute. Ooh. My bad, y'all. almost dropped my phone. Um, But that's going to be the end. Of, wait, let me make sure. Yep. I was making sure that was the end. So... Whew. That's going to be the end of this reaction video. If you liked it, I would like for y'all to hit that thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button, you feel me? Turn the notifications on. Notification squad. And Pyramid of Bosses signing out. Until next time, I'll see all y'all later, boss.